Meow, meow, meow. Oliver and Chumpy, story 17, up the tree. Only a few meows away grows a very tall tree right into the clouds. I was always tempted to explore this beautiful old tree. So, one day, I said to Chumpy, I would try to climb all the way up to the top. I packed my backpack and was soon on my way, up and up, one branch after another. It was harder than I thought. I'm sure you like tree climbing, don't you? But this one is very tall. Eventually I arrived at a bird's nest with three very hungry babies in it. Their mummy was scared that I might eat them. Soon I had explained to her that I am allergic to birds, so there was no need for concern. Further up, where the squirrels live, I was received in a more friendly manner. Looking out from their cozy tree hole, they waved me and wished me good luck in my journey to the top of the tree. They had never been so far themselves. I was very tired already, so I took a nap leaning against the tree trunk when mighty thunder woke me. A storm had surprised me. Lightning was striking nearby and soon my fur was soaked by the heavy rain. It was frightening and I felt miserable. After finally the last drops had fallen, I put this dreadful experience behind me and continued climbing until, to my surprise, I arrived at a tree gnome's village. Gnomes are very friendly little fellows and soon they had unpacked their instruments and gave a concert in my honor. Some refreshments followed. So high up the tree, they don't see many visitors. My arrival was a good reason for a big party. After all the food and entertainment, I was fit to finish my task and saying goodbye, I continued up again until finally reached the top of the tree. What a view! It had become late and the sun was setting. A colorful rainbow framed the world. I was very happy because I had seen all the inhabitants of the tree. It is very important not to cut down the big old trees, because they are the home for many animals. Don't you think so? Well, the question now was how to get back to solid ground before nightfall. Let me show you what I can do with a tablecloth. Puffy pie!